Well, my friends, in this video, we're going to be checking out the Graveler or the Timmer Graveler for the Excavator here. So let's get into this video. All right, first starters, we're going to go ahead and use a tire here. All right, so you can see the tire. This is a 1.5. Uh, graveler tire. How about that? It says actually graveler. This is from my uh, the trail walker here. So let's go ahead and see what we can do with it. So, all right, we got that wide open. Drop it down. All right, there we go. Close it up. You can definitely see the force of it right there. Look as I squeeze the tire more, there you go. That's really pinching the tire down. That's not going anywhere. So that's one. Open it up. <laughs> Tire rolled. All right. So the next thing, let's do some toxic waste. A little something stuff in there. Open it up. Kind of like playing a claw machine there. All right, so next item, let's try a rock. Concrete, actually. Now, I'm not exactly sure if this is going to work or not, but we're gonna find out, right? Slowly turn. I love that you can slowly turn this thing and not have to worry about going like this. All right, let's get positioned over it. Open up that claw more. Close it. All right, we might have to, I picked a odd piece of uh, concrete to uh, pick up there. Open it, let's get, get a bigger grip on it. There, we've got that all the way there. I had to pick the, like, the most crazy looking piece of concrete out there on the park. All right, let's... Well, it's a no-go for the rock, or the piece of chunk up concrete that I used. You can see there's really just no way of gripping this thing. I don't know, I hate to give up, you know. Let's try this again, maybe Mike can get. All right, I think. Yeah, it's just not gonna happen with this. Not gonna happen whatsoever, I hate that that happened maybe we could find something else yeah why not so let's try the d7e dozer now let's see if we can pick this thing up all right 
Let us back it up, trip this thing up a little bit. All right. All right. So let's get it down, close it. Oh, that's as far as it can go right there. <laughs> Check this out, my friends. Let's see if I can get the camera. Look at it. Ah, it picked up the RC dozer with no problem. How cool is that thing? Let's bring back the camera a little bit. There you go. That is crazy. Still moving. Show you guys, no string or anything attached to it. That is the raw power of the Tanya excavator here. It's like a <laughs> kind of like a kind of like a theme ride here. All right, let's bring it down. So, there you go, my friends. And yes, I said friends again. <laughs> I keep keep uh, I keep saying that word a lot because I, I don't know. It's just a word that comes to my mind uh, a lot there. Let me move the, sun, the light out of my <laughs> face there. Uh, but as you can see, the excavator does great. We had a little mishap on that rock there, on that piece of concrete that I picked up. I should have picked up a better portion of concrete, but I just did not do that. So I am terribly sorry for that part. I did not want that to happen. I should have picked up a better size rock. I mean, I got tons of them out there in the park. I could have picked up any one, but I picked up that one for some odd reason. But anyway, you saw the raw power of this machine and what it can actually lift. I mean, it lifted up the D7E dozer. So that's pretty amazing. So I know that, you know, if I'm out in the construction field and this dozer needs to go somewhere, I can pick it up and carry it, but I don't know. <laughs> but I, you know, there's a lot of things you could try here in the room, but this thing does have a lot of grip and force. As you've seen in the video, squeezing the tire, it really squeezed that tire very, very well. Uh, picked up a lot of good things, so yeah, so. So, yeah. So, I hope that you liked this video. If you did, smash that thumbs like button. Comment down below if you got any questions. Anyway, my friends, thank you for watching, and I will see y'all later.